White Lines Review Netflix's murder mystery in Ibiza Netflix's new series White Lines by Spanish creator of Money Heist Alex Pina was released on May 15 and already stands at no. 1 of the Netflix UK. In the middle of the Spanish desert, a body has resurfaced after torrential rain has unearthed it. Zoe Walker, played by Laura Haddock, is at the scene with the Spanish police force. She has just flown in from Manchester with her husband to identify the body to be her brother, Axel Tom Rice Harris. He disappeared 20 years ago while he was living in Ibiza working as a DJ. He moved there with three of his friends from Manchester, who all still live on the island. After finding out that her brother was murdered, Zoe decides to investigate herself his murder. She moves to Ibiza to find her brother's best friend, Marcus Daniel Mays, who moved to Ibiza with Alex. However, she is not the only one searching for her brother's killer. Alex's body was found on the land of the Calafit family. As the police detective is quick to inform Zoe, this is the desert where Italian spaghetti westerns were filmed. It has now been turned into a theme park. Fearing that his son or his wife had something to do with Alex's murder, Andrew Calafit Pedro Casablanca asks his right-hand man, boxer Nuno Lopes, to look for the murderer. White Lines opens with Zoe saying that she feels she has lived more in the last 24 hours than she has in the past 24 years. She is confessing to someone everything that has happened. It will soon be revealed that she is fast-timing her therapist. This narrative device helps the spectators get into the story, and as they will find out as the series unfolds, this is really Zoe's story. Traumatized by her brother's disappearance when she was 17, Zoe needed psychiatric help. Investigating her brother's murder may be a way for her to find closure. The story is told through a series of flashbacks. They are all Zoe's, the way she remembers the past and her brother. Memory is here presented as fleeting moments that repeat again and again until new meaning is assigned to them. Zoe's memory of Alex living Manchester with his friends, for example, returns again and again. The series uses repetition like the beat in rave music that continuously repeats itself until it suddenly becomes something else. By revisiting these memories, giving them meaning through her investigations, and finally talking with others of her brother, Zoe slowly finds herself. Thanks for watching, like, comments and share, subscribe for more latest updates and don't forget to press the bell icon.